think this is some of the best lake monster footage I've ever seen. What we've got to worry about now is it budging its way out. We've never seen. That's crazy. Until now. Until now. We didn't know what it was, and uh, as we were swimming closer, it, uh, it was actually bigger and bigger. It was like an alien thing in the water. Which is um, one of the largest squid that we know of on the planet. It's certainly the heaviest, up to about 500 kilos. It's 12 feet long, about 4 feet wide, grey in colour. It seemed to be moving into the waves against the wind, occasionally breaking the surface. Often these fish will come to the surface with their stomachs sticking out of their mouth because of the extreme pressure. Ranging from unknown entities to terrifying beings. Keep your gaze fixed and prepare to embark on a journey of astonishing discoveries hidden within the world's rivers that have left the world in complete awe. Giant Octopus Now look at this cephalopod clinging to the fishing net. This incredible moment was captured earlier this year when a Vancouver Island resident was fishing with some friends in the Alberni Inlet. The trap that was sent down to catch prawns, but it came up with a giant surprise. Whoa. You're kidding! That? that is so huge! Oh <laughs> a massive red-colored Pacific octopus was entwining itself around the entire trap, likely attempting to pilfer some of the prawns. <laughs> Given the difficulty of hoisting the massive octopus out of the water, they chose to release it back into the depth shortly after capturing those thrilling moments. Towie <laughs> Towie Squid Measuring a whopping length of 8 feet. <laughs> What you are watching right now is a giant squid that became the talk of the town when a Filipino angler captured this deep sea monster during his fishing expedition off the remote island of Tawi Tawi. According to him, the squid was already in its expired form and was believed to have been ended up by some other giant predator. Shocked residents crowded round the bright white squid just to witness the biggest creature ever captured in that region. Squid Strike This guy was out fishing when he noticed a squid swimming nearby. Since it was not an everyday sighting, he quickly decided to catch the rarest being. However, it was not as easy as it seems because the squid quickly turned into a defensive mode spurting its ink out, making the man realize he messed with the wrong opponent. Fortunately, squid ink poses no threat to humans, otherwise this fishing trip could have turned into a nightmare for the man. Massive Anaconda Rivers surrounded by a dense forest never brings good news, it's always full of horror. These guys on an expedition across the forest in Spain came across a horrific sight. A huge anaconda was lying in the water around the acacia palm trees. With its body fully enlarged, the anaconda was resting after devouring a large animal when these daredevils thought to poke it with a huge tree branch. Until it lunged toward them. But calm down, it was just a warning. And well, it looked like the guys were not ready to stop with the fun. I'm watching if I gotta do <laughs> Loch Ness Monster Australia. And here is another sighting of the Loch Ness Monster in Australia. Well, a supposed Loch Ness Monster. They caught sight of this strange and horrific looking creature swimming in the river in Sydney. And it doesn't look like any sea creature you already know of. Look how huge and bizarre it is. Although people have been calling it the mythical Loch Ness Monster, still, I would like to hear your thoughts on it. Unknown Creature in China Before you start making assumptions, let me clear this is not a hippo. It does look like it, but it isn't. 
Locals in China came across this strange creature in a river, and nobody seemed to know what it was. When the video went around the internet for people to identify the creature, they also had mixed opinions. Some said it could be a male Blainsville beaked whale, while others suggested it could be a new species of salamander. However, no one is still sure about the exact type of strange species. Coiled Serpent Under the verdant canopy of the Amazon rainforest, a group of fascinated anglers stumbled upon a mesmerizing sight by the riverbank. High above them, a colossal anaconda lay coiled on a tree branch, basking in the dappled sunlight. Its massive body shimmering with iridescent scales seemed to be glistening. Was it truly soaking up the warmth, or was it a trap set for any creature daring to venture too close? What do you think the clever serpent was up to? Dinosaur Search in Congo Some Japanese scientists went on an expedition in search of the leftovers of the Cretaceous period across the Congo River, a long-lost dinosaur. And they even claimed to have caught the Plesiosaurus on camera. This dates back to 1992, hence the poor video quality. But as the video surfaced, people had different opinions. Some said it's an elephant. Some had their votes with Makali Mambi. What are your thoughts? Is it really some creature from 145 million years ago or just an elaborative elephant? Yangst River Monster this one was caught on camera in the Yangtze River, China. You can see a slithering serpent-like creature in the water. China might just have found its own Loch Ness Monster. It's just this one is too long to be an eel, measuring somewhere around 10 feet. Witnesses say it stretches to about 10 feet. The video got the Chinese media by storm as people were curious to know what this strange serpent was. Some suggested it might be nothing more than trash or an alligator, but there is also the possibility of it being a Loch Ness monster lurking that day. What's your take on this? Craw Grandad Curiosity makes you do really dumb stuff, and here is one of such instances when this angler went to play with the odds. While on his expedition across the river, a man caught sight of a rare but dangerous creature. Without any fear of being bitten by it, he dipped his hand down there to catch it instead of using any specialized tools. There we go. Yes. yes. From under the layer of river debris, he brought out a huge crayfish that was causing great terror with its sturdy claws. But it looked like the angler's excitement to catch this creature ruled out the terror as he stayed calm. Mystery Creature Another massive squid? Or just a huge river monster? The enigmatic creature following the viral spread of its video has left experts completely perplexed. As its true identity is still an unsolved puzzle. Many have claimed it was a globster, but researchers have completely rejected this theory. Speculation abounds that it might have been a decomposing whale that washed ashore, transforming into an unidentifiable object. <laughs> Mysterious fish. Imagine catching a fish that is way too bizarre to be a fish. The fish net came out with hundreds of fish, but this one stood out and gained attention. I mean, look at that creature. Have you ever seen this kind of fish before? At first, the fisherman thought it was some river debris that came out with the fish, but it was moving, counting its last breaths. That got the fishermen curious, and they tried to poke it to check what it was. It didn't even resemble any known river animal. Since the video is too old, 
its features are not too clear. But this strange entity from the Karviv River did stir the world with its mysterious appearance. Swamp Monster In the middle of the night, a shaggy-haired creature emerged from the shadows, startling a group in Indonesia. Engrossed in filming their archery videos, they sensed movement along the river. A creature so masterfully camouflaged that its presence was nearly missed. It seemed trapped, attempting to approach them. With nerves of steel, the group watched, maintaining a cautious distance. The creature oddly did not harm them but left them baffled. Was it a mere animal drenched and muddied or an undiscovered creature? The mystery hung in the air, inviting theories, and we would like to know yours too. Before we move any further, like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon so you can keep watching our amazing content. Alaska Loch Ness Mystery while checking out ice on the Chena River six years back, a worker in Alaska was stunned to see a strange serpent floating in the icy water. I was turning to go back to the office when some motion caught my eye down in the river. My first thought was, what in the world is that? After posting the video on his Facebook page, he left it to the world to decide. The video shows a peculiar curved and attached formation in the river. Well, that's what I thought, but then look how it curves and it's all attached. Prompting discussions about its resemblance to a sturgeon or a cold water alligator. My first thought would be a sturgeon, but sturgeons dwell at the bottom of lakes. It looks like an alligator, which we know it, it isn't. <laughs> the sighting has perplexed many, and there is uncertainty about the nature of this mysterious entity in the river. Floating Mystery Look at that creepy creature floating on the water. It looked like it had been flowing with the water for a while now. This unknown figure was captured back in August 2019 and has left the netizens scratching their heads as no one, even the videographer, was unsure about his mysterious discovery. Although many have, it could be the carcass of some animal, or maybe a Loch Ness monster, but nothing could be said about it. Mysterious Creature That huge shadow lurking in the river doesn't seem to be comfortable in showing its presence, as it stayed under the water creating an eerie suspense. It seemed like it was growing in size as it moved. If you first look at it, it may look like a school of small fish, but then it can also be a river octopus as they grow in the river with time. Look closely and you will see the ink and tentacles. But we still can't be so sure. Do you think it can be some river monster? Waterfall Mystery Moving on to another mysterious presence that was captured in the waterfall in Atlantica. While this family was just having fun enjoying the pleasant sight of the gushing waterfall, they captured the sight of something coming out of the shower like it had its home back there. A humanoid concealing behind the rushing water suddenly emerged but quickly vanished back. Let's watch it again. A Bigfoot? Or is there some ghost residing near the waterfall? Even after watching the clip several times, people are still unable to solve this waterfall mystery. Baby Dragon A guy was strolling by the riverside, enjoying the gentle sounds of flowing water, creating when all of a sudden, his eyes captured a sight, a sight too whimsical to be true. A creature direct from the fantastical world, a baby dragon just floating in the clear water like it's just another day. After capturing the rarest of rare sights, 
he decided to post it and let the netizens guess. Was it really a baby dragon or something else that resembled the outlandish creature? What do you guys think? Unknown creature. Look at that floating creature in the water. Can you recognize what river animal that one is? Because nobody yet could. A group of fishermen were on a hunt across the river when they caught a sight of this strange being swimming partially inside the water. Although its mouth was pretty clear, it didn't look like any river creatures that we know of. What do you think? Is it some new species that hasn't been discovered yet? Unidentified Creature Here is a mystery straight from River Foil. Almost a decade back in Ireland, a guy was out fishing when he noticed a strange creature moving up and down the water. At first, he thought it might be an alligator, but the shot of its back of head seemed too large and wide. He tried to follow it to get a clearer shot, but the creature quickly vanished from sight and never came back. Although many have claimed it was beaver hunting fish, according to that, it was some unidentified creature that was lurking in the river that day. Monster in Lough Foyle. Ten years back in Ireland, a group of students was shooting a class project in the Lough when they saw a huge, dark object that appeared on water surface and quickly started moving towards a nearby boat. What is that? See it? It looked like a whale from afar, but according to the guys closer to it on the boat, it was not a whale, but an unknown creature. Maybe some undiscovered being? The eyewitness called it a Loch Ness Monster. What are your thoughts? Goodness. Icelandic River Monster Here is another possible sighting of a river monster. Locals in Iceland saw a serpent-like creature in the lake that was slithering its way in the icy water. Apparently, Iceland has a giant worm monster. Seriously. It was camouflaged so well with the water that if it was still, nobody could have pointed it out to it being an alive being. Suddenly, Iceland isn't laughing about its own version of the Loch Ness Monster. And while seeing an unknown bizarre creature in a river, people were quick to call it a Loch Ness Monster. But there were other speculations as well that totally opposed the mythical one. As some folks said, it was the Laggerjot River Worm. Do you believe that there really is a lager floats orm. Not that a living creature. Croc Carcass. The fishermen saw something weird floating in the water in an upside down position. Was it just relaxing or had something far more ominous happened beneath the surface? The air grew thick with tension as they approached, their hearts pounding in anticipation of the truth lurking beneath the surface. It was when the strange being floated near that they realized it was a poor beheaded crocodile's carcass that left the people in grave concern, thinking what tragedy could have fallen upon this apex predator that it ended up like this. Kansas Monster A man was on a fishing trip across the Kansas River when he saw a mysterious creature swimming in the water at a distance. It looked like the creature didn't want to show itself and was laying low, but that man claimed he had seen that eerie unknown being four times in a day. But the netizens seemed to have quite contradictory opinions, as they just called the supposed monster nothing but waves or the meeting of two wave fronts. Since the visuals are not very clear, nothing can be confirmed yet. Mystery of Ganges River A fisherman stirred the internet with his discovery of a shark that was never an inhabitant of the Ganges River, a huge bull shark. Suspense gripped the internet wizards as they huddled closer, pondering the impossible. Doubtful comments surfaced with confusions arising among them. But then someone pointed out it's no bull shark, but just a giant carp. 
Another chimed in, calling it a catfish. The tension dissolved, revealing it was a misidentification. Yet the mystery lingered. What's your take? Shark, carp, or catfish? Share your thoughts. Lake Monster A peaceful kayaking trip turned into spine chilling when the river out of nowhere began to bubble like a witch's cauldron on a stormy night. Weird shit. Just bubbles coming from the bottom of the lake. Kayakers were left staring with their jaws dropped and utterly perplexed. It felt like nature itself had gone haywire. They paddled away faster than ever thought possible with their hearts pounding. Go, go, go! What the f Those innocent bubbles hit a deadly sinkhole, a gateway to who knows where. Trust me, if you ever spot such a spectacle, paddle away like your life depends upon it, because it just might. It's a mystery that still gives me goosebumps. Mysterious Fish Earlier this year in New Orleans City Park, a mysterious creature was filmmaking waves ripples in its serene lagoons. Several visitors to City Park recently have spotted something they've never seen before. This enigmatic aquatic denizen, fish-like in appearance with peculiar scales and a striking red tail, has left park visitors both intrigued and baffled. It's nothing I've ever seen before, on land or in sea. Speculations are swirling across the internet, suggesting it could be a genetically modified creation set free in the park's waters. Even a local preschool specializing in sea creature studies has failed to identify it. Into sea creatures, and we have not seen anything like this before in our books. So, could this creature be New Orleans' own Loch Ness Monster? The mystery of this unknown creature is still unsolved. I am pretty well convinced is the Loch Ness Monster of New Orleans. River Monster The fisherman's plans to reel in a good fish turned into an extraordinary experience as he cast his topwater lure in hopes of a catch. The water erupted into a frenzy, making him stumble backward. With his pounding heart, he saw a massive 11-foot, 5-inch creature come on the surface to get the bait. With its dark body and strange worm-like shape, the fisherman thought of it to be a river monster, which left him awestruck. Tension was hanging in the air until the video got the audience's attention, and it was revealed that this was no monster, but a majestic ancient marvel. It was a huge sturgeon that had taken away the fisherman's breath. Mysterious Deceased Creature Now take a look at this bizarre creature that had people confused at its identity. A fine evening for a woman turned out to be very spooky while she was collecting seashells on the California beach. She spotted something really strange. Woman picking up shells along Crystal Beach earlier this month spotted something, river monsters. <laughs> it was this lean and long creature with its mouth open that had seemed to beach itself. The creature remained mysterious at first, but according to the Wildlife Department, it could be a snapper eel. The Texas Parks and Wildlife Department told the San Antonio Express News it could be a snapper eel. As they are common in Galveston Bay. However, to some, it resembled a unique variety of alligator gar. He said it was some special alligator gar. That's mm -hmm. what it looks like to me from my experience. I'm going with you, man. What does it look like to you, though? Monster in Los Rios Now, let me introduce you to another possible Loch Ness Monster sighting, but this one was captured in Los Rios in Chile. The creature was really huge in size and didn't resemble any discovered residents of the river. This video went viral and it made the news as the whole region was interested to know the reality of this unidentified creature that was bringing havoc in the river. But since the video was made from really far away and the creature wasn't that much visible, nothing could be said with surety. Sudden Scare These guys were on their recreational trip across the sea when all of a sudden, their relaxing moment turned horrific. An enigmatic creature suddenly emerged, sending colossal splashes 
cascading over their boat. Fear took over their enjoyment as they thought of sea monsters swirling in their minds. But hold on, it's not what it seems. The viral video that ensued captivated the world, revealing that these weren't monsters at all. In fact, they were manatees, also known as sea cows. It's their usual behavior when they are spooked by the humans. Loch Mari Monster The employees of a museum started an aerial investigation after hearing reports of strange splashes and noises in Loch Mari. An unexpected visitor, probably Chessie, was visible in a recently released video. The excitement was sparked by this enigmatic figure that had arrived prior to the 2014 talk at the museum, or to see the prehistoric displays of his old friends. Researchers and enthusiasts actively investigated the mystery, recording sightings and taking pictures. The incident combined mythology and scientific inquiry to provide an engrossing human narrative. Zombie Croc In a bizarre incident from October 2020, a decapitated crocodile near a river displayed unnerving post-mortem movements. Initially reminiscent of a horror movie scene, the disembodied creature blinked its eyes and moved its snout. It was found by a farmer who believed it had met its end while clamping its snout shut. This eerie spectacle was attributed to the reflex twitching of muscles in reptiles after death, dispelling the supernatural notion. This spine-tingling encounter serves as a reminder of the enigmatic workings of nature, even in its most unsettling moments. Drawcadile one hazy morning, a group of seasoned fishermen set out, their eyes hopeful for a bountiful catch. As their nets sliced through the water, they suddenly glimpsed a gargantuan set of eyes lurking beneath the surface. A behemoth tail just like that of a huge dragon emerged. But wait, it was the most dangerous crocodile they had ever seen. Its sheer size left the men frozen with terror. It was a prehistoric relic, a living nightmare. Its immense body seemed to stretch forever, scales glinting in the sunlight. The fishermen, awestruck and horrified, hastily retreated, their stories spreading like wildfire through the island. Scary Turtle If you think turtles are gentle, think again. This thrilling encounter unfolded when a group of guides stumbled upon a river monster in the Amazon. And this beast here, this is uh, in its own right, it's a bit of a river monster, this river turtle. This is only a medium-sized one. A medium-sized air-breathing turtle. Cautiously handling the powerful creature, they marveled at its surprising weight. They carefully brought it to the river's edge to examine it closely. But on the way, spot two of my guides on a sandbar. However, the situation took an unexpected turn when this seemingly slow reptile extended its neck, lunging at its intruder. Luckily, the man standing nearby remained safe from a sudden strike. Put this back in the water where it's going to be safe. The guides then decided to release the angered turtle back into the depths of the Amazon. Mekong Catfish In the waters of Cambodia, a fisherman's ordinary day took an extraordinary turn when his line pulled up not just any fish, but a giant Mekong catfish. A creature so rare, it's like finding a diamond in the rough. But there was a twist. The majestic fish was tangled in a heavy rope, its struggle for freedom palpable. With a heart full of compassion, the fisherman called National Geographic. See their last night this morning? The fisherman caught a Mekong giant catfish. Who promptly arrived, setting the giant catfish free. This colossal catfish, two meters long and weighing 200 pounds. Over two meters long, six and a half, seven feet long, probably 200 pounds, critically endangered fish. Was more than just a catch, it was a marvel. Riverbird. 
Moving on to this weird river creature that looks like it's some kind of a river bird. I mean, look how it's flapping its wings while swimming in the water. I mean, it, to me, it looks like a bird flapping its wings <clears throat> underwater. <clears throat> this one was captured across Pali Island in South Carolina, where this strange looking creature was seen swimming in the water. The guy who shared the video didn't know what it was, but internet guesses pointed out it was just a sea slug or a sea hare and nothing to be scared of, as they are absolutely harmless. Unfortunate Elephant No, that's not a whale. This one was a saddening sight. A group of fishermen was on their expedition in the River Nile when they saw an elephant in the river. <laughs> the poor animal had been lying on its side and wasn't moving at all. Concerned, the fisherman approached it to check if it was still alive, but even after multiple nudges, it didn't wake up and was already deceased. It's unclear how this unfortunate mammal ended up there in such a condition. However, wildlife officials believe that the elephant was injured and couldn't survive. Amazon River Monster it's safe to say that the Amazon is home to river monsters, and here is one of them. You know, the Amazon's filled up with all sorts of river monsters. The anglers were on an expedition across the Amazon when their expedition got interrupted by the rain. Then we began to hear thunder and see lightning. But they didn't know that rain could prove to be a blessing in disguise. They had to take shelter in a creek to keep their aluminum boat sound. That's not good when you're in an aluminum boat, so we took cover and all of a sudden they got a glimpse of an arapima in the water that had come out to gulp air. <laughs> Measuring approximately eight feet in length and weighing nearly 440 pounds, this arapima was one of the largest river monsters in the Amazon. Finally, ah man, that's a huge fish. That is a huge fish. After a few pictures were taken, it was gently released back into its watery habitat. And away, and away he goes. Great White in Cape Cod No, that's not you daydreaming, but it's actually a great white in the river. I mean, did it forget its way around the ocean? That it ended up here in Cape Cod? While the tourists were exploring the area, they caught sight of something that made them rub their eyes for a clearer vision but it didn't go anywhere and was a real juvenile great white. Actually, what happened was that the young great white shark had entered the river on Cape Cod at high tide after being attracted by the aroma of salt water. And well, it came far away from its home. Remains of World War II Rivers are not only hiding the mysterious creatures and monsters, but they are also hiding the secrets from the past. While a group was on an expedition across Europe, they came across a forest that was surrounded with swamps from its sides. They had to stop in their tracks at the site in front of them as it was something they would have never imagined finding out. It was a huge tank partially sunk in the water. Upon detailed analysis, it was found out that it was a tank from World War II. Crashed Airplane while doing a drone survey around the area, the camera captured something that was totally unexpected. Back in 2018, this guy was taking a tour around his neighborhood in Leesburg through his drone when he saw something strange in the waters. Curiosity got the best of him and he zoomed into the object that was partially sunken in the water. But what it turned out to be literally blew his mind as it was a crashed plane that was partially inside the water. In this huge swamp, it may look like a toy, but it definitely wasn't, as you can see the runway nearby too in the zoom out version. Playful Octopus Now, look at this octopus in a naughty mood. It looked like it didn't want to be filmed. That's why it was trying to chase away the guys by using its built-in water gun. It even tried to run away from the guys, and when that didn't work, it went on to hide under the rock. But I guess the innocent octopus didn't have an idea that it was too big for the rock, and the water was too clear to hide it. 